I don't like this at all. Yeah, let's leave. There's a fucking chair. So I just really made a really like difficult life decision to give up my dream school, like my top tier dream school that I got into and to go to my state school just because of Corona and stuff. Um, whole, whole ordeal. Doesn't matter. But I decided to go rando nighting. Um, you know, that whole trend that's going on TikTok. <laughs> and I went with the intent to, you know, get closure to make sure that I like made the right decision. Um, oh, and by the way, the decision is to go to Kansas University. And let, let me show you. Let me show you where I fucking... What. So I got taken to this weird ass park. You know, weird. And at first I saw this horse, I'm like, what the fuck? Why? But a KU is literally carved into the grass. Um. So we decided to play Rando Nautica and it took us to this random detention center. It's just kind of a dead end back here and immediately it rerouted us and she got a text from a random ass number that said, are you real? And we decided to come back to check it out. And it just says real. Pee pee poo poo. We're gonna see what it takes us. That's kind of scary. Ooh, that's kind of scary. Is my engine light on now? I don't think I should do it. My engine light is on and my passenger seatbelt thing is like saying that it detects a person sitting in my passenger seat. <sighs> right after I downloaded the fucking app. I'm gonna turn off my car and redo that. Bitch, I'm scared. Hell to the love. So, a little update. Um. Okay, so this random nodding app just brought us to this creepy town. And honestly, when we saw this, we should have turned around and left. We continued up the mountain, though, and there's always abandoned cars and nobody around. At this point, we're definitely trespassing. We couldn't even really turn around at this point because the road was so narrow and it was such a steep drop off on the other side. But we were kind of intrigued at how creepy this was, even though it was getting dark really quick. And next thing we know, the sun had gone down and the moon came out, giving it just more of a creepy vibe. But we had the pin pulled up. We were so close to it. Dude, and this what happened. the fuck is... I don't know how to explain this. We're the only shit. ones around and a random rock falls. I think that was a sign that we should leave. But we, uh, we kept going. Everything about this place was just giving me really bad vibes, and when I looked into here and saw this, as soon as I realized it's some sort of face, we took off running. I don't know what it is with this town, why there's all these abandoned cars, and no people, and mannequins in the window, but I'm deleting this app. Hi guys, so me and my friend went rando nodding with the intention of memories and it brought us to this old train station in my town that's been abandoned for a while. We were looking around and then we found these Polaroids on the train tracks. This one was labeled vandalism, which was kind of funky, but we were looking at them and they're super cool. And then we went looking around and we found a bunch more, which was awesome. So we picked a couple of them up. I don't know if we're gonna keep them, but we wanted to like look at them better. So we brought them to my car and looked at them. This one says Holly is not a virgin. Holly sucks. I don't know who Holly...